What's up everybody, my name is Potato and welcome back to another server Saturday. We're kicking it off this week by visiting Shaharo is apparently how you pronounce his name. I think I put Taharo last last season or whatever, but it's he has it written here, Shaharo, I think. I hopefully I'm doing that right. It just started raining. God damn it, weather sun. Um He's built his uh Casa uh Casa 2 the club 2.0 and uh, he has an outhouse right here which is uh, cleverly labeled as just poo poo and uh, don't forget to flush but you know really flush in an outhouse it just kind of goes into a hole and uh, and that's about it and he has a shit ton of chickens here from what I can hear I'm probably gonna let a lot of them out by trying to get in here but uh, I like his little tables outside with the with the pistons and as you guys can tell, I'm also on the uh, the Fax or Sfax texture pack, and uh, so no John Smith this week. You gotta keep it, uh, gotta keep it fresh, mix it up, and uh, and try new things. And I I have grown to like this texture pack. It's definitely a texture pack that is much better when you play it. Um, I'm just gonna put these in my Ender chest here, um, because no Ender chest is owned by anybody. Because they're all there's so many chickens in here. I, I thought that was like a mustache at first, but it's chicken feet. I didn't see the chicken. Hello, would you like to come out? No, okay, that's his room. Just a bed, not where the magic happens. I find that hard to believe with a thousand chickens in your house. I'm just gonna start throwing these eggs at, at other chickens. Um, so. Yeah, no, sex texture pack, whatever. Uh, press your face against the chest. I don't get it. I don't, uh, I don't understand the, uh, the importance of that. But, uh, okay, alright, fine, you know, press your face against the chest. Uh, got a balcony back here where you can look out into the forest and, uh, and enjoy all of the fantastic... I was gonna say fan fantasticness, but uh, I realized that that was not a word. But I guess I could have just said it anyways, because when has that ever really stopped me, honestly? Uh, making up words, mispronouncing people's names, you know, everything like that. Let me pick up all these eggs. There you go. Um, so it doesn't look like he has a downstairs inside of here. I saw the stairs outside. I thought that there might be uh, stairways or stairs, a set of stairs that go. Uh, underneath his house uh, but nope that's interesting I've never seen anybody put a trapdoor up like that before huh. dance floor not balloon no balloon dance I don't know what the balloon dance is so I, I assure you I will not be doing that uh, the drink the drink and a drink interesting so I guess there's uh there's different there's there's I would like the drink and I would like a drink I guess is how he's going about doing this. Um, barbecue 2.0. Okay, this is a, that's the exit, exit mofo. I don't know if this is the right side to be on. I guess usually it's the right side. Club 2.0. Everything's 2.0 here. A little bit better each time, you know. A barbecue place like this would be pretty cool. And I was gonna say it would have to have an open top and he has one so there you go he's thinking ahead so that's good what do you got in the chest nothing in the chest over here another house at warp casa jenga takes you to a jungle far away uh well we're not gonna be visiting that place this time around mr Sharharo. but um if you want to resubmit that we'll we'll come back and check it out anyways we're moving on to the next place and this next place is built uh, by two two girls. Wait, hold on, I should probably check real quick before I, I call. Yeah, it's Saji. Saji's the third person. I was gonna say it's built by three girls, but I didn't want to. I wanted to make sure that the there was three girls, or if it was just two. And uh, it's a mountain house, so let's go check that out. All right, so we arrive on over to Talea. Oh my damn! And Saji's mountain home. Now they built this house. Uh, Damn near the near the beginning of the uh, the map being created because this is one of the first builds I saw because you could see it from spawn, and um, 
There was another house back here too, but I guess he moved it. Um, hmm. So, let's check out this place. Got some signs out here. All right, the three people who worked on it. Alyssa, whatever. Okay, well, we know who built the house. We don't need seven signs to tell us. <clears throat> and uh, no, no signs in here labeling these rooms. So let's just start peeking our head in and see if we can't make out what they are. This must be the uh, observatory deck with complimentary cake where you can overlook the amazing spawn that uh, that has been created for this map around. Over here, what is it? Storage? Just uh, just storage. You know, it's a simple room. Keeping it keeping it uh, real simple, you know. I like this picture. This is this is a good picture. Is it's just kind of like he doesn't really know what's going on. But he's in hyperspace or something. You got lava in the house because what what house is complete without uh, a pillar of lava? <laughs> uh, just hanging out. And this seems to be more storage and just uh, just furnishes, Fur furnishes, furnaces, just furnaces in there. That's all there is. Quick peek upstairs, and we got uh, another another hangout room. I don't. Okay, you got beds in here. No, just a, just a single bed. Oh, okay, I get you. It's like a bunk bed. Just pop up here, go to bed. But down here, you got a desk. I forget what those are called, but I think there's a name for this where the beds and then there's a desk. I don't know, but um, this is, this is a neat little room. I like the uh, I like the wool up here. I wonder if that's uh, if that's something up top or if that's just for the ceiling here. And uh, more cool windows to to check out spawn. And on the opposite side, we have. Uh, this seems like the boys' room. I don't know why, it just feels less happy when you walk in here. I think it's because there's no windows. So it's just kind of like, eh, whatever. Guys don't really care. This this place over here, this this seems like a like a girl's room, even though it is blue up there. Oh, there you go, right there. Uh, yep, see? It's, a, it's one of the girls' rooms. So does that mean that there's a sign on this one? Am I right about this? Nope, it's Tess. It's the other girl. I was wrong. I don't think Saj actually lives here with them. Um, because that's the end of this house. <laughs> There's no more rooms in here. Um, there's only two rooms. And how did he help? If he helped, why doesn't he get to live here? I don't understand. And uh, right outside we have a dirty hut, which apparently was defiled by Bunchies and Cobra. And I'm not going to go in there. And uh, a little pond. It's a tiny one, you know, you don't need anything big, just a tiny, tiny pond. Um, we have a staircase down here that goes and checks out these buildings. Where they have the farm, which is all in caps. And uh, the Chicky Bunch, Glow Bacon, Two Bits, Gloria the Sheep, Alfred the Cow, and Misty Monroe the other cow. You have one cow, and, and that's it. So I think... Either Alfred ate Misty or Misty ate Alfred. Oh no, the cow's over here. Well, what the heck? I'm still getting used to the animal textures of this this pack. But the sheep is here. I think Gloria is a slut. I think that's what's going on. Got two pigs and a couple chickens. All right. Pretty simple enough. I mean, we've seen all we've all seen a bunch of farms. Okay, just a mine. Over here, what is this? No meth lab in here. Have a nice day. Okay. This is not a meth lab. This is just a place where they make Kool-Aid. That's probably it. The painting is not suspicious. Okay, well, I'm, I'm glad it's not. You know, it's not like I always try to go behind uh, paintings anyways. There's a bed here. Is this, is this where Saji lives? Does he live in the meth house? Because that'd be an awful place to live. I would, I would not want to live in that house. You never know when it's going to get raided. So I assume this is a, the other farm, or a greenhouse or something like that. They got melons of wheat. What else do you need? I don't know. But that That's it, really. I mean, if you if you really break down the Minecraft truth until... Um, I think it's going to be 1.4, hopefully, that we get all the, uh, the extra 
food and stuff like that. I know there's uh, there's thought and and word of potatoes and stuff like that, and uh, I assume the 400,000 people that have contacted me telling me that there's going to be potatoes in in Minecraft aren't lying because I do not do not check out the snapshots. It's too much. It's 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 like it's like checking out a broken game. You know, this game already has its problems that need to be fixed, like this. Flowers don't do that. What is that? Huh? That's not how flowers work, Notch. Or Jeb, now. I guess whoever you want to put the blame on. Let's move on to the next place, guys. And we make our way over to Mr. Treefall's place, or Blitz on the server. He just calls this place Birch vs. Jungle. And, um, it seems to be just an island that he's fabricated. In the middle of the ocean and uh, I really well no, I guess there is land right there I thought this was uh, really all by itself but no there's some land right over there um, seems to look uh, or seems to look it looks pretty cool I mean I like I like uh, places that are built in awkward places you know like nice things built in the desert and like things built in the middle of the ocean or up in the sky stuff like that the phantomatic food place. Phantomatic food place. Which, uh, apparently there are no orgies allowed. So, uh, I can't go in. But I'll just stand on here and check from the outside. Looks pretty cool. Looks like you got, um, you got a nice view over here of, uh, bricks. St stone bricks over there. And, uh, okay, well, let's just, let's go to a place where I am, I'm actually welcomed. Why does this one have a door? Oh, okay, that's the kitchen. Okay. I get ya. And over here, I, I, I'm just going to make an assumption. I think this is the jungle area. I, I could be could be wrong. Um, I, I, you know, it, it, could be, it could be the birch area. Maybe there's some hidden birch somewhere that I, I'm not seeing. I guess this is the jungle wood on this texture pack. I haven't had too much experience with jungle wood. Just uh, basically regular wood. And um, that's... I don't... It's very... It's, it's orange, it feels, you know? Like, has that orange... That reddish orange feel. Y you guys know what I'm talking about. Is there not a door to this place? Oh, it's on the other side. <laughs> it's covered in vines. Boop. Right inside of here. Looks like these are, um... Is this like a resort place? Is that, is that what's going on? There's like, uh, bedrooms in all these places here. Ah, ba -ba -ba. Go over on this side. Yeah, these are all the same... Little rooms. You got some stands out here, so people could come over here and sell their junk to the dude that's sleeping. Like, hey, come buy this compass. Fifty bucks. Oh, uh, come on, buy. It. There you go. Oh, damn it. Okay, just walk over to me and buy this compass. Fifty bucks. And that dude's gonna make himself a sweet fifty bucks, and uh, he'll have the the time of his life. Let's see. Is there anything up here? No, no, just um, just trees. But you get to get a good look of the whole little island, which is pretty cool. Woo! Boop. Let's just fly. We'll just f we'll f we'll fly back over here, cause you know flying's allowed here. Hopefully, not not on the server on the on the resort, and only for me, um, cause I got a season pass to flight. I I got my flight license from flight school. Pretty sweet. I, I keep expecting these buildings to be bigger than they are, even though I can I can literally see through them. But like you see something like this, and you like you walk in, and then like six blocks, and you're already at the back wall. I just I keep expecting it to be bigger, bigger on the inside, if you if you will. Which I believe would make two weeks in a row that I've made a a Doctor Who joke. I could be wrong. My memory is a little fuzzy. Um, but I like I like the style. This 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 could have been a, a cool place. I mean, <laughs> that makes it seem like like a, I think it's a bad place. It's not a bad place. I just like I said, I assumed it to be uh, to be bigger. My expectations are high on the server now because everybody feels like they gotta step up their game. So every build that they make, you know, is crazy. The standing bar. Hopefully, there's orgies in this place. But then again, who would want to have a, a standing orgy? That just that sounds awful. And over here, I'm going to uh, make the assumption that this is the birch area, which uh, has doors. 
unlike the jungle place, which is um is very open. You know, you just let anybody in. Got more stalls here in the back. And this is brightly colored. I like I like the wool in this in this texture pack. It's nice. Very bright. And and, uh, and happy. And uh, I like the I like the green green squids, green and pink squids. Who wouldn't like those? And I like the leaf tops on these too. It it adds to the freshness, you know. Like this should be renamed Citrus County or something. Something weird like that. Like it like it needs a weird name, you know. I guess these are more stalls here, but um, there's no gates to get into them, so you just gotta climb over the fence. That's fine. It's fine. Just climb over the fence. That's cool. Am I just seeing things down here? Yeah, I sure am. <laughs> There's nothing down here. Okay. It doesn't work. Okay, there we go. I was going to say, it, it barely works underwater. So I believe that's it. Um, we got this one little place over here. Oh, no, he has an underground place. Awesome. Okay. Uh, I guess this is a boathouse. Oh, sweet. It doubles as the ceiling from underground, too. That's cool. He has a little crane here. Let's go boop, boop, boop. And uh, a hole to drop the stuff in. That's that's cool. I like that. Let's go check out what's uh, what's down here. So, um, oh, this seems to be an office or something. Maybe this is uh, where you apply for your flight permit. I assume that that long thing down there is a mine. Pop on over here. And... Uh, Tree fault, man. You gotta, you gotta use some signs, man. For, for, for places like this. Other places I can kind of make up, but this one is like, okay, this, this is an office, but there's like a, a desk here. Does this dude always stand up? And and do his thing. I don't know what this is. Uh, this is for. I do like the pink carpet. That's very cute. Um, pink carpet, dirt ceiling. You know, it's a good combo. Uh, over here we got uh, more water. What's? Oh, it's a shower. Okay, I get it. I assume that's probably the bathtub, or or the toilet. I don't know. You got you got to really work at it to get it in there, you know. And by it, I mean your butt. Got to really work to get your butt in there. So uh, I didn't see a way of getting into the um, the storage area. I guess this is it. Oh wow! I like the uh, I like the arches and furnaces, and uh, all the chests. That's a very interesting way of putting out chests like this. Got a bunch of cobblestone down here, huh? And another ender chest. That's not the ender chest, dummy. There we go. Just put that stuff in there. I like to keep an empty inventory when I can, um, which is not always possible. But uh, yeah, this is uh, Tree Falls Place, aka Blitz, and uh, that's actually going to complete our service Saturday this week, which I know, it's uh, we're still getting through all the stuff, all the beginning stuff. I know there is a lot of people working on bigger projects on the server, but um, still, I like these, these tiny little areas because they're quick to, 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 to explore and commentate, and uh, they have a lot of character in them, you know? Like this fountain. Look at that fountain. It's just gonna light up like like no tomorrow during the nighttime. You know. Uh, one more quick bit of news. Like I've been telling you guys that there is going to be applications opening real soon. And I said the 12th. Today is the 13th. And the applications actually opened up on the 11th. But uh, the only people that knew were people who follow me on Facebook and Twitter. I know it's a travesty. If you guys aren't following me on Facebook or Twitter or both, then then you guys are going to be left out of the loop for this for all these amazing stories and 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 videos I find on on, on tubes like that American Idol video that I'm sure a lot of you guys saw on on my Facebook that I put you which you should all watch because it's just it's great. Um, but yeah, guys, applications for Mongoose Country are open. So uh, make sure to go check it out. Read the news article or the uh, the blog or whatever, the journal, whatever you want to call it that I, uh, I posted on our website to kind of give you some hints and tips on how to make your application stand out because it is very tough to get into Mongoose Country. It's, it's a shame. I'm, I'm sorry. But I do like keeping it a small 
group of people because then everybody's all nice to each other they get to know each other and, and no one's a dick you know no one no one's a dick to each other if they are then you know if it becomes a problem then then we ban that person or that person just doesn't hang out with that person anymore you know um yeah i'm rambling this is what happens when i don't know i just want to talk to you guys you know i don't stream enough so i want to just talk to you guys and uh for those of you actually who speaking of streaming um I've been playing through the game Dishonored via Twitch TV, so if you guys have missed any of that or are interested in that game, check out my Twitch TV. There's about six hours of gameplay already up there, and uh, it's a very, very fun game. Anyways, I gotta go. Apply on the site. Go check out mongoosecountry.com. Hope you have a great weekend, and I'll see you guys later.